right guys, it's Neil here with Wondershare Film More A Go. We're here to help you create your videos anywhere on the go. So today we're going to dive into keyframes. So what is a keyframe? Keyframe is like a marker for parameters for changes in sections of your video. So it could be a change of speed or a zoom in and out. Keyframes are little markers to dial in the info and they look a little bit like this. They're also really useful for tracking and tracking stickers, which is what we're going to do now. So I'm going to show you how you can use keyframes with stickers in Filmora Go to create some really cool, fun effects. OK, so we're going to go into the Filmora Go app and we're going to import our clip, which is just me sort of moving around in my kitchen. I'm just going to delete the start of the clip that I don't really need by selecting the clip, then the split tool and deleting the first bit of the clip. OK, so now we've got all the clip that I want to use. So now I'm going to go to my sticker option. I'm going to go through the sticker packs. I'm basically looking for a sticker that I can stick over my face. Um, so like an emoji or something like that. So I'm going to go through the sticker packs, loads here to choose from. Here we go, animated emoji pack. Use this one. And I use this one with the shades because I am really cool. Okay, I'm just going to line it up at the start so they both start at the same place. And I'm just going to click my keyframe icon so that we start doing the keyframes. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to keep going through my video clip and moving the emoji so it lines up with my head and it will automatically create keyframes. You can see the keyframes getting created on the sticker timeline. So you can make the emoji bigger or smaller by pinching and you're just going to move it so it lines up with your head all the way through or my head all the way through. Okay, now once you've done that, just going to go in and fine tweak it. So as you can see, it goes out of sync a little bit here. So we're going to go in and put in more keyframes just so it moves with my head. So my head's covered the whole time. So just go through the clip and anywhere where it goes out of sync with your head or your face, then obviously you're just going to move the emoji so it covers your face. If you move forward, you might need to resize the emoji to make it bigger. Move back, resize the emoji, make it smaller. Just basically so it follows your head around the screen. As you can see, it creates new keyframes wherever you move the emoji to. It's quite important to make sure your whole head is covered the whole time, otherwise the effect doesn't really work. So once that's all done, you're just going to chop off the bits at the end that you don't need from the video clip and the emoji clip. And then just go to export and export the video or share it to your social media using keyframes to get this really cool little effect with this emoji. OK, so now we're going to have a look at how we can use keyframes in Filmora Go to create zooms in and outs to make your videos a little bit more visually interesting. OK, so we're going to open the Filmora Go app and we're just going to import these two clips. I basically made a coffee earlier and just filmed myself doing it. So let's import these two clips. OK, the first clip, I just want to zoom in when I hit the button. What I'm going to do is select the clip, select the keyframe icon, then I'm going to zoom in by pinching and dragging so that when I hit the button, I'm zoomed right into the kettle. Then I'm going to create another keyframe a bit further down the timeline where I zoom out. I'm just going to delete the last part of the clip that I don't need. Split and delete. And the other clip is just me pouring out the water into the cup. Get rid of the first part of the clip. And then I'm going to select the clip, select keyframe. And then I want to zoom in when I start pouring. So I'm going to zoom into the cup by pinching and dragging. And that'll create a keyframe. Then I'm going to zoom into where I finish pouring. And I'm going to select the keyframe icon again, which will create another keyframe with the same parameters. Then I'm going to create another keyframe where I zoom out. So it's going to stay zoomed in for the duration of the pouring of the water. Then it's going to zoom back out from the cup. OK, then we're going to, just going to select a 1080p resolution and export our clip. And from here, you can also share it straight to your social media channels.
and that's how you can use keyframes to create zoom effects in your videos. Okay, so there you go. So that's how you use keyframes with stickers and to create zooms in and out in Filmora Go. Hope you found it useful and I'll catch you in the next video.